Hey guys, John here. Welcome back to the series, How to Use Harmer. This is video 11, and today we're talking about the Harmonizer. So let's load up a default patch here, and let's talk about the Harmonizer, located in the center left-hand side of the synth. So the Harmonizer is going to clone and transpose the existing harmonics in your sound. And these first three buttons here, the first one is a mount. Uh, I think it should have been called the mix knob, but it's called the amount knob. It's basically the, the mix of how much Harmonizer is in your sound. So we can already see or hear the difference there. And then this width is going to determine how many of those clones are going to be present moving up on the frequency spectrum. And then the third one here, this STR is strength, so basically how strong those harmonics are going to sound, so how, how loud they're going to be. And you can see how much brighter they get here, even on the uh, uh, spectrum view here as well. And then this kind of uh, tuning thing is very similar to the pitch that we talked about earlier. So a quick dive into this, you're going to see offs and steps. So the offs is going to be an offset in octaves, and then the step is going to be an offset in harmonics. And then we look down here, shift. Shift is going to shift the harmonics relative to the fundamental. And then gap is the gap between the first harmonic and then the higher harmonics. So it's kind of a lot to think about at first. It's easier, I think, to kind of play around with it and listen more to what you're doing to the sound. And as we move up, we can see it starts to turn it into a plus, so an additive, and then if we scroll down to the bottom, it's going to be a multiplier. It's really one of those ones I feel that you kind of have to play around with it for a while to get something decently okay from it. And an, a good way to kind of visualize this is for the harmonizer. If we go to the advanced tab and then we get the harmonizer and put it after the second filter here. And let's grab uh, the frequency cutoff and kind of bring it down quite a bit till we see maybe just the first fundamental here about. And if we turn this uh, amount knob up, we can see the harmonics that it's adding. In this width, we can see how it kind of just goes up on the frequency spectrum. And then obviously the strength is going to make those partials a little bit louder. And we can see moving this, how the harmonics change. And that's pretty much what it does in a nutshell. I would suggest to kind of play around with it, spend some time with it, get to know one another, and maybe you will come up with a very cool patch that has the harmonizer in there. So yeah, that was the harmonizer in a nutshell. The only two buttons you can actually articulate is the amount knob here, edit articulator, and the width knob here, edit articulator. The strength one doesn't have that, so it's only these first two knobs that have the articulation as far as all these other uh, mappings are concerned. So hopefully you learned something, and thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next one.